welcome to Adept Tutorial. This time we bring you a smart robot car controlled by Microbit, and we will explain the control of the RGB LEDs on the robot. You can see that there are six RGB LEDs at the bottom, and thirty-four ones surrounded by a circle on it. So the whole body has forty RGB LEDs. Then how to control it? First, we insert the micro bit into the slot and put the battery in it. Pay attention to the anode and careful, do not reverse them. Then connect to the computer. Schematic. The RGB LEDs we use are WS2812B. You can see that this is the connection schematic of RGB LEDs. The RGB LED connects to pin 8 of the micro bit. VDD connects to the anode. GND connects to the cathode. The digital out connects to the next RGB DIN and so on. Connect the following 39 RGB LEDs. This is all for the schematic. Now open the provided PDF. Turn to Project 1 NeoPixel and move up a little. You can see that these are all the interfaces of the story bit. If you don't remember the ports when you are coding, just check them here. Then here is the reserved ports, which is convenient for you to do the expansion. And pay attention to the anode and cathode of the battery, do not reverse. Now see project 1 and start coding. First we open make code page. Previously we enter this interface. We can edit codes directly. Now the interface has changed and we've reached sets of functions. You can see the following tutorials, games, radio games, and more interesting examples. So now you need to add new project yourself and then enter the code editing area. Of course the code we provide can be clicked on home. We can find the project we previously opened next to add new project. In the corner you can see there is an import. The page here also has minor changes. The previous version just has the import file. Now the function of import URL is added. Click import file and find out the location where the code is placed. The path depends on where your file is stored. Click go ahead. Now you see the codes. The new version has become cuter. Hope you like this language more. Now I'll give you a little explanation of the code. Here you can do some settings of the rainbow LEDs. This is the control pin and the control number of LEDs. Here setting 41 just in case the last LED doesn't work. Set the brightness to 100 and this is the effect of the rainbow LEDs. Now open the plugin, download the code to start a bit.
switch on and you can see the rainbow LEDs is lit. Switch off. Some LEDs still are on. This is because their power supply is from the micro bit. Unplug the USB cable, they will be off. And switch on again. Enough. Now come to the Python code. Open the new Python editor. Click load. Then select the path where the code is stored. Um, find out the file ending with py click open here you need to add the microbit header file and then add the math library and the neopixel library you need here to define the control pins and control number of RGB LEDs Define all the RGB LEDs. Display forms. Define the displayed color of RGB LEDs. Define rainbow LEDs. Finally, write display rainbow in a loop. Then the rainbow can be displayed. Click Flash to download the code to Microbit. Make sure the Microbit is connected to the computer. After the code is downloaded, unplug the USB cable and switch on. You can see that the rainbow LEDs are on. Okay, here is all the explanation for the RGB LEDs. In the next tutorial, we will explain the functions of the starry bit. If you have any questions, post to our forum. We will reply to you as soon as possible. See you.